market. Afiyat Sinai Tsekun. We are. We are. We are. We are FEF. We are FEF. We are FEF. <laughs> That's it? Is that what you wanted? All of us are FEF. If you want access to the best and brightest, uh, you really need to be involved in FEF. The students that go through FEF are, are more qualified to be in, you know, be in the industry than, than any other field. We've been an FEF uh, supported school since 1979. You know, many things today we hear constantly at university is budget cuts, uh, reduction in funds, and that makeup has to come from somewhere. And we get that support, that extra dollars from FEF to be able to continue to do what we do to recruit students to the industry. They promote us to go and see different foundries and speak with people, give us opportunities to sit down with people from industry and learn about it before you're actually bound to it. And there really is no other industry that does this type of recruiting. I mean, it really is unique and um, exceptional, the way that they do it and the way that they really, you know, make these kids feel special and bring them into the industry and, and really, you know, jumpstart them into a career. And then we also have to give back as an industry to these students so that they're successful and help the industry. The reason that FEF works really well for us is because you already have students who are predispositioned to come and work in the foundry. They've got great key professors who bring them up in foundry technology and they just, the, the passion is there. Without FEF in place, now we're basically industries back to beating the doors of well, where do I find these, these individuals? The, the biggest thing that I think though is um, the support that they give our university so that we can uh, maintain our lab equipment and in some cases buy new equipment or sometimes just pizza for the students so that they can continue working in the lab till two or three in the morning as usual. We are FEF. This is our college industry conference uh, known as CIC. It's uh, interesting that we call it the CIC and that's it's known throughout uh, the metal casting industry. This is where we uh, FEF brings in it's really its top uh, students uh, ready to uh, graduate and really uh, put them with industry in a career fair uh, college fair type atmosphere. Trying to mate that passion with what we do is really key. It's key for retention, it's key for building leadership I know most of the representatives, uh, their HR and their, their you know, foundry managers and, and engineers uh, personally, so I can, I can try to um, funnel the right students to the right job, because it's got to be a fit on both sides. FEF is really our key recruiting opportunity for all the foundries. We are FEF. As a professor, FEF has helped me in my career uh, because it's really provided me with a network of folks from industry as well as folks from academia. My academic advisor is Daryl Weber. He's actually the FEF key professor. Of course, I already had in my mind the, the metals industry, and he kind of fostered that and pointed me in the right direction. Anytime we go to a conference, he introduces you to everyone. Um, he does anything he can to get you interviews, get you internships and then eventually getting new jobs. So, I mean, it helps you network. He takes you to conferences like this, get to meet a lot of people who are willing to help you. At least once a year, I get invited to a wedding uh, for my students, and that's, that says a lot. We are FEF. 
I don't think anybody who who pursues a certain future uh, just wakes up one morning. It's a it's a developing process. Many of these uh, students that we have. Uh, are learning the trade, and they're actually uh, working on all their internships in the summer. I know that whatever I do, I'm going to excel at it because I've had to work so hard to get here. So I already know I'm passionate enough to succeed. We are FEF. So if you see you know, metal being poured in the foundry, you know, one of two things is gonna happen. You're gonna be really interested in it, and you wanna get up close to the action and what's going on, or you, know, you see folks kind of step back. And once you see liquid iron or steel, you're pretty much hooked on it. So if we can get the kids out in the industry to see the liquid iron or liquid steel, that's half of the battle right there. They call it sand in your shoes. When you have sand in your shoes, that means you've been in the foundry because the sand's work its way into, the, into your shoes. And it, once you get it in there, you can't get it out of your shoes. We are FEF. <laughs>